Hi friends, this is Asrar. In this session, we will discuss about login with cookies and logout in ASP.NET. So just look at this. I have created the login uh, format as a username and password. While I'm clicking the login, the page will redirect to a control panel page and the cookies has been created. After that, I'm going to click the logout button. It will delete the cookies and uh, redirect to default page. So look out this. Uh, this is I have created the username and password has a text box and uh, getting the cookies. So just look out this and uh, code behind. I have created. I have give the connection to the database and get the uh, username and password from register form as I have created the table as a register form and from this I am going to get this so if it is one it has to create the cookies and redirect to control panel page if it is not correct it shows the message as a check your username and password <coughs> So in this, I'm going to create the cookies by mentioning the HTTP object, HTTP cookies, and naming the cookie as my cookie equal to new HTTP cookie. I'm going to assign the value, I assign the name of a cookie as login. You can mention the any name in this as I am mentioning as a login and going to assign the value of the cookies as my cookie assigning as username and getting the username from the text uh, database as a dt dot rows dot rows uh, zero th rows and uh, column name is username dot to string and after that I'm going to set the cookies to expire in one day as uh, my cookie dot expires equal to date time date time dot add sorry date time dot no add days I'm going to add the days as uh, giving one day I'm going to set the ex uh, cookies to set as a one day and adding the cookies to the my my cookie collection has response dot cookies dot add to my cookie after creating the cookie I have to redirect the page to the control panel page so response dot redirect for redirecting you have to use like that uh, response dot redirect and you have to mention the URL in the in this double quote so I'm going to add the control panel dot ASPX okay just saving it and I have not created the control panel page so just I'm adding a control panel page naming as control panel dot ASPX so just adding this and in this I'm going to read the cookie values if it is uh, available it should show the logout button and uh, reading the cookie value if it is not it should have to redirect for the default page itself so in this uh, I'm just going to copy the heading and just pasting into my page and copying the styles which I have created for this so just I'm um, copying this one and pasting into my head section and 
in this I have a login so just I am going to call that as welcome and reading the cookies by creating the label in this label I am going to read the cookie value and I have to add the button also so that the logout button should uh, delete the cookie button ok adding and naming the text box as log out and while I am going to click the logout it has to delete so I am going to create the event so just saving it and calling the class which is due ok just saving it and here also I have to call the CSS which I already created the as a button and in this button I have to set that it should be float in right side of the page right top right of the page so just I am saving it and going to run this page so already have run and refreshing so look at this I am going to add if it is I am going to read the cookies if the cookies is available it should show the logout button and if it is not it should have to redirect to default page itself. So request reading the cookies as request dot cookie, which I have created login is not equal to null, which means if there is anything in cookies, it should true the condition, and if is if it is not else 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 condition response dot redirect response redirect default dot aspx ok just saving it and if it is so just I'm going to read the cookie value in label dot text as uh, what request dot cookies which is in login I have added the sub key as user underscore name dot to string you have to give the name which is you have created username copying this one and simply pasting it already have given so if it is the cookie is available it should show the name and if it is not so response dot redirect so just I'm going to run this you can see that there is no cookie has been created it will redirect to default page so look out there so it has been redirected to default page because it has not created the cookie values so just I am going to create the cookie then I am redirecting so after that I am going to first I am going to create the cookie has username which is going to see the database table I have username Tom Jerry and password has one two three four. So just going to create the Tom Jerry and password giving one two three four. So I'm going to click the login page, login button. It is redirected to control panel and has created the cookies as well because I have passed the. I'm going. To, I have read the cookies as a, as in the label. So when I am going to click the logout it has to be clear the cookies and redirect to default page I have not created so I am just going to create the cookies 
sorry i am have to delete the cookies and redirect so just i am copying this as i have created so look at this i am just copying this we have to do one thing in this that you have to remove this and you have to set that which i have set the cookies to create for one day now i am going to set has a minus one day because uh, plus one and minus one equals to zero so just I'm saving it and one more thing I have to do is uh, it has to response that redirect to default page after logout so just uh, saving it and going to refresh now I will uh, going to click the logout it will clear the cookie and redirect to default page so just I am closing it and now while I am going to run the control panel page it will redirect to default page because the cookie has been deleted look at this the while I am run the control panel page it has been redirected to default page so this is how I'm, I have created the login and log out using cookies hope you enjoyed if you have any queries just feel free to comment it and if you like this don't forget to like share and comment have a good day